This here is a Sturmey Archer 3 speed cartridge that came out of a 1980s Gazelle bicycle with drum brakes. And I've been trying to find out a good way to bench test this uh, cartridge. So uh, basically test it uh, in the vise without a hub shell. And the easiest way I have found out so far is uh, eliminating this uh, this spring. So I have not installed a uh, cone. So at the moment the clutch is uh, all the way down just like it would be when it uh, is uh, pushed down with the spring and that should be uh, third gear and if I'm turning the driver this one here the uh, ball ring that's this one here should turn at a faster rate than the driver and you can see that by looking at the uh, notches on the driver and on the ball ring and it definitely looks like the uh, ball ring is outrunning the driver so this uh, is good so next I'm going to pull up the indicator pin to the position where it should be into uh, second gear about here and then I'm installing a little glue clamp and basically that glue clamp is my shifter Now in second gear, when I turn the driver, the uh, ball ring should run at the same speed, should turn at the same speed as the driver, and it does. The notches here and there are turning at the same rate. So to me, it looks like second gear is good. And now for first gear, I'm going to pull out or pull up the shifter. and put on the glue clamp so now the hub should be in first gear and I find first gear a little bit uh, harder to test at uh, this gear uh, the ball ring is uh, free to turn Now when I turn the driver, uh, the driver should turn at the same rate as the ring gear, this one here. And when you compare the speed of the ring gear to the speed of the uh, uh, planetary gear cage, that's the lower one here, you can see the uh, lines on here. I'm not sure if you can see that, but these uh, lines that I... Uh, drew on here they are running or turning faster than the uh, planetary cage so looks like the first gear is also working in conclusion I think uh, this cartridge is fine um, but if you have uh, any uh, tips on how to uh, improve uh, my testing method I would like to hear all about that. Alright, thanks for watching.